Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to be explaining to you guys how you can add IDX to your website on Squarespace. So let's get right into it. Now, adding an IDX or an MLS search to your site is very, very simple. All you have to do is just add the code and pretty much every IDX service does have code, which it will give you this is HTML code, which you'll then need to copy onto your site. And you can very easily add that to your site with one simple addition or with one simple box. So let's get right into it. Now, once you're on the page where you want to add the search, just click edit in the top left and then add an empty section or whatever kind of section you want. And then you'll be able to add blocks. Now the blocks we're gonna wanna add, you can add two, you can add the code, which I wholeheartedly recommend. You can then click it drag it around and resize it to your heart's content or you can add another block and you can embed it into your site which is something like this it'll add an embed block to your site and now you can click on whichever one you want to click the edit button and here if you use the code block you can select the mode as html and then paste the html code over here uh, and if you want the embed block just click here code snippet, go and click embed data and add your HTML code here. You should have the uh, similar results for both. However, I do wholeheartedly recommend the uh, code block route. Once you're done, just click save. Now, certain IDX providers will require some additional code added through code injection. And to add that code, just go over into the pages menu, scroll down, go to website tools, go to code injection and add it under the header or footer settings, depending on what you want to achieve, as well as the lock page. And that is basically it. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll be seeing you guys in another video.